welcome! We are here today to talk about this amazing loan that we got from OPT. They've loaned us this crazy amazing mount for like six months so that we can get a pod. Which I hope we get soon because we have like what, nine or ten, nine months to get it before the end of the year? The weather's been pretty bad here. We'll try. Anyway, this is going to be an unboxing video. Um, unfortunately, I'm not going to be in it because I'm working. And uh, so it's going to start Antoine, your favorite guy for unboxing videos. No, you're the favorite. No one likes I you. am the favorite. Anyway, I miss you guys and sorry that I'm not in these videos, but you know. Soon. Soon. We'll find the time for episode 14, I hope. I've had a great job, so I feel like that makes me happy, but I'll try to be in more videos more often. Yeah, so anyways, they sent us also a telescope to go with the mount, a pretty crazy telescope. Uh, sadly, there were some issues with the telescope. I will show you guys next week. I used it once and I got uh, one target with it. Um, you will see why I had issues, so I'm gonna send it back. But um, yeah, we, we're gonna have the mount for six months, so we can use that with our, our Ryan Astrograph. But anyway, uh, let's go to the uh, unboxing part of the video and um, yeah. In these three packages is something I never thought I would have in this apartment, ever, in my entire life in this hobby. If you don't know what a Mighty Paramount is, uh, let me show you real quick. This right here is in the three boxes. Even Gilbert is happy. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, I guess uh, the tripod also has its own bag, which is nice. Magnificent. Ta da! Oh my god. I love how there are three bubble levels, one on each side. It's really nice. And uh, I'm guessing it's really helpful for leveling the tripod. Okay, I actually have to read this because if I break this, I might as well just jump off a bridge, right? So I'm gonna make sure I read this correctly first. Thank you for this nice picture. Thank you very much. So I'm not sure what's next. Um, bunch of cables and stuff, okay? All right guys, so here we have it's the actual mount, so this part right here uh, in this box. Are you ready? Are you ready? Wow. Magnificent. Magnificent. Yes. Yes. So apparently we have to make sure that the um, both uh, axes are locked before lifting the, the mount from the box, so that's good to know. Good. So guys, if you're gonna buy a new mount, uh, especially this price, make sure you read this beforehand. All right, this is already rocket science. So many hands. I'm lost. A quick look around. That's insane. Would you quick look around? I have my serial number here. I'm guessing it's for the warranty and uh, outputs here which we'll go over maybe in the review video okay so let's see what's in this box there's a bunch of stuff in there um i'm gonna just go and grab everything and just see if i know what it is or not this seems to be some kind of uh, power brick then we have i think some other cables i think it's a hand controller which looks really really strange i hope you can see it looks super strange, okay? Once again, guys, I will make a better video about the mount later when I, I'm familiar with it. Right now, I'm just going through everything, like, um, you know, without any research or anything. Then we have uh, more cables. Oh my, I'm scared. <laughs> so many cables. Then we have some kind of, oh my, what? All right, first of all, there's a USB flash drive here. I'm guessing it's, I'm guessing it's for softwares or updates, I mean, um, at first glance, but Paramount Quick Start Guide. There must be like 20,000 pages in there. <laughs> okay, I have to go through this today, tomorrow, and the entire week, I guess. <laughs> okay. So underneath is, I guess you cannot really see, but it's the, the weight, the counterweight. And the counterweight bar, which is super heavy. The bar itself is super heavy. 
Uh, if you have a mount like the Atlas EQG, the bar is like nothing, but this one is heavy and it's thick. I want to see it. Oh. It's really, really heavy. I, th I feel like it's the same, it's the same weight as a, I don't know, as something. Wow. Please don't roll out and break my toes. And then one huge counterweight. And when I say huge, I mean huge. Okay, I need help. If Daya was here, she could help me, but <laughs> just kidding. All right. It's really heavy though. Damn, it's really, really heavy, like seriously. Uh, compared to my, you know, what I'm used to, uh, my, uh, my Atlas. EQG uh, counterweight. Just in case you want to see it better. Look at that. <clears throat> so in this flash drive here, we have, um, I believe, some uh, updates for the mount and also the software like the Sky X, uh, which is to be installed on the laptop or computer um, to control the mount. Once again, I'm not really sure about all this, but I'm going to read through this um, 206 pages um, guide here and uh, this is the software that you need to install the Skydex but yeah this looks like some uh, crazy stuff time to learn this is what came inside this kit bag uh, a bunch of uh, little things that we need for the mount to function time to mount the mount on the tripod. Let's be very careful here. Okay, I have those uh, screws here. Okay, so I'm gonna keep using the mount and learning how to use it. Um, I also have to learn a whole new software, the Sky X. But, um, so it's pretty complex. And then I'm going to teach Dahlia, hopefully, how to use the mount. It's very different compared to the uh, Atlas EQG. But I'm not sure if she's going to be able to, to learn the mount. We'll see. And then after like a while, we're gonna make a review video on it, uh, a full review. Uh, I just don't want to rush into it before we actually master the mount. So I want to use the mount like 10 times and then make a review video and see if it's actually worth the price, the crazy price tag, or if it's, uh, you know, so-so. <laughs> so we'll see. And uh, yeah, so we'll see you guys next time. And kiss guys. Bye. I'm so glad I can actually take the time to learn this from home and not have to do it directly from the desert. So many pages. I also want to give a big thank you to Alan Mitchell, who is a fellow YouTuber as well, for taking the time to teach me how to use a mount. He owns the same one and spent several nights walking me through everything and I cannot thank him enough. The best thank you I can give him is if some of you guys subscribe to his channel. So please go check him out. He makes amazing in-depth tutorials about astrophotography and his videos are super helpful.